This is David, Superintendent with Southeastern General Contractors. We're out here at the Silver Job, checking on progress. Come on, let's go check on the framers. We're here in the great room. All the banging and noise you hear around is the framers actually making progress. So here's one of the first things we go through to kind of make sure that the framers are getting everything done that we require in our custom homes. Here's our framer checkoff list. Okay, when we go over all of this frame and checkoff list, that means we're pretty much finished with this house. This helps us keep track of everything and also helps them from keep from failing inspections. One of our first items on our checkoff list is the check in and out. When they check in and out, that's actually helping us keep track of progress because we know who's on the job, who's not on the job, and also make sure everything keeps moving. As far as our framers checkoff list, we go over everything. Down to the brick ties on the home, brick pockets, anytime floor joists or above foundation vents, we have to double it. I mean, each county is actually just a little bit different. And this helps us keep track of different counties, what they require as far as their inspection. All right, so this is our checkoff list. So we're gonna show you how we implement it. We actually take string lines and check all our walls. Because if we don't, what's going to happen is you're going to come in the house and you're going to actually have bowed walls, crooked studs, and everybody's going to be complaining that it's not straight. So we go and actually on each wall and check for any variation. If you see the orange marking on the outside, that's implementing that we don't have the block in here. And that's for our framers to know that this is a problem area and we need to come back and actually block it all the way around. Because if we don't, that's more room for error. The studs can twist, the bow, and you know, anybody don't want that. I mean, like I said, we're professionals here. We want our stuff right. We check all our walls like this, just to make sure. If you look at this stud, it's twisted at the bottom, twisted at the top. We mark this because it, it's a future problem. We'd rather change it now than get drywall on the house and we have to come back and change it later. So now we walk through the house and we actually went through our checkoff list. We actually marked up every spot that's an issue. Also, I jot it down in my phone. That way it can be shared between the team, me, Ralph, and Drew. After that process, everybody's not quite as tech savvy as we are. So what we do is we'll come up, just take a scrap block, we'll put it on the wall, and we'll go over everything that needs to be addressed. Because this is the most important part, communication. So you can never mess up with too much communication because if you got it broke down like this, they can go over there and just mark it out. When they mark it out, they know it's taken care of. So when they get everything marked out on the list, we're good for inspection. This is the framing stage out here at the Silver Job. Our next steps is to get our insulation and drywall. This is David Teague, Superintendent with Southeast General Contractors. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos like this. Southeastern General Contractors, where making clients happy is our number one goal. Learn more at southeasterngeneralcontractors.com.